In Billy, settings are separated into two categories, organization settings and user settings. Organization settings affect the accounting system with the business that you're working with. User settings affect your specific login credentials and what you see when you log in. In this video, we'll give you an idea of where to find specific settings that you're interested in. Under Organization Settings, you can edit your contact information that appears on invoices and upload your company logo. App Settings is where you'll find settings that pertain to your invoices and bills. There are also a couple of settings for bank synchronization and product defaults. Templates is where you can create a custom template for your invoices, quotes, and estimates, and other documents you send to customers. Payment Methods is where you'll add instructions for your clients on how to pay you. You can also set your currency defaults for each payment method here. Tax Settings is where you'll enter your fiscal settings like tax calendar year, sales tax reporting frequency, and also where you can edit your opening balances once you've modified your chart of accounts. Users is where you can see a full list of all users that have access to your organization in Billy. You can invite new users or transfer ownership of the organization on this screen as well. Products is where you'll find your product list and all of its associated information. Here you can import or export your product list and make edits to their default prices. Tax rates is where you can edit and adjust your sales tax rates and rule sets. For more information on this topic, click Accounting and Sales Tax to watch the video. Your subscription is where you can view and edit your current subscription with Billy. This is also where you'll update your credit card that Billy charges for your subscription. API tokens is where you can go to generate an API token. These are used for building custom integrations with Billy. For more information about this, visit us at billyapp.com API. Delete account data is where you can clear your Billy account of all information. Please note that all deletions made here are final and cannot be recovered. Now we'll move on to user settings, or settings that only affect you when you log into Billy. User profile is where you can add your name, contact info, and profile picture. This is also where you can enable the For Accountants view for advanced navigation. Notification settings is where you can personalize your email notifications in Billy. You can set default notification settings or customize them for each individual organization you're a part of. Theme is where you can change the color of the sidebar. I personally think that wood is the coolest. Language is where you can toggle your language settings. Right now, we only have American English and Danish available. Let us know what other languages you're interested in. Change password is where you'll change your password if you need to. It's a good idea to do this every once in a while to keep your data safe. Finally, we have privacy settings. This is where you can grant permission to a Billy support agent to access your account if you're having problems. You can enable or disable this at any time. Looking for something else? Let us know by reaching out.